Welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Dana and my channel name is Only In My Dreams. I just wanted to come here and share with you um, a box that I received from eBay. These are items that I won off of one auction and this is for my dollhouse miniature 112 scale hobby. Um, I was in need of um, several things and especially a very large door. And this one is um, Houseworks Jamestown six panel door with um, side lights, meaning the openings here. And this is a nice big one. It is a 112 scale. Of course, it is a six, um, six uh, point five, 16 by seven um, by one sixteenth high. So it's a nice, big, beautiful door, as you can see. And I'm hoping that this will be the ticket to my very large dollhouse that I have here behind me. Um, I'll put uh, a link to my dollhouse miniature uh, videos if you want to go check out that house. It's huge, huge, and it's absolutely beautiful. Um, it's like a house that, you know, I would even love to have in real life. <laughs> so I got this. I was really happy to had won it. Um, so I'm going to show you everything else that came along with this auction. So I got this beautiful door. I'm going to put the door right here for now. Actually, let me put her here. So I got that door. <laughs> then along with that door, um, I got these. They came these... Um, um, new post. They're called Newell posts. These are six pieces. So they came with that. And one set of these larger type, type um, louvered shutters. But you can also convert these into, you know, um, if you get like more than one set, you can make this into a folding um, bifold that you can use as a decorative screen. But they only, I only got one set of that one. I got three sets of the louvered shutters in this smaller diameter. This is the Houseworks 5025. Um, so I got three of these and they come in sets of two. I'm not too sure if I'll be able to use this on my, on my house that I've been working on that I've been sharing with you. But I'm going to find out if I can um because it's a better cup so this might be too big but i'm gonna check it out then it did come with one of the um, shenandoah designs builders collection two-piece package of legs um, these are very beautiful decorative legs as you can see these are great so when something breaks you can just replace it then um, these are the decorative um this is called decorative brackets um these would look very nice in a Victorian style house and there's four of them. Then I also got the Yorktown pediment. So you get two of them. Um, these look great. Not only outside of the outside front door, but these, if you want to make your own, um, fireplace, you can use this pediment as a top piece. You just build the bottom. And then you have a very nice, beautiful, beautiful decorative. If you see the detail in that, do you see the detail in that? Look how beautiful that is. So you would have a really beautiful mantle. Um, you know, it's all up to you on how you want to work your hobby. Along with that, they sent this. I won that. This is the Shenandoah Designs as a two um, piece a decorative. If you see the detail in that's very pretty. Look at that. Then um, I also got a two piece side lights. Um, this is uh, for 610. This is not going to go. Uh, well, it says it goes with the Jamestown. It says it does. It's two of them in there. I don't know if you could see. You see the design. It says it goes in there, but I'm not too sure. I'm honestly not too sure if it'll fit, even though it says it does go with it because I'm looking at it. Maybe it'll just fit. So these would go right here on the sides for the side lights. Okay. So that's what would go with that. Then along with all of this, I also, all this is all one auction. 
I got the Houseworks York, Yorktown double hung windows. These are, of course, non working, so they don't go up and down. Some windows do go up and down. And um, it does come with removable acrylic, which is really nice. So it's two of these. And if you can see, they're very decorative. Now, if you don't have a house or if, if you don't have like um, a house to work with this, if you don't truly need it, if you decide to make a room box, you can create a window and use these and it'll look beautiful. Or you can dismantle these and create other things with it. Um, again, this top piece right here, if you see all this decorative top piece here, I hope you guys can see that. Um, that would be great for a fireplace or as a mantle. Um, and you can use the wood pieces if you dismantle them for other things. It's up to you on how you want to, on how you want to work that. Then along with that, this one is a traditional non-working window. So it doesn't have all this decorative, all those decorative, um, you know, um, notes, as you could tell, it's very plain. It's simple compared to that one. And then lastly, the two last pieces, I know I got a lot, right? <laughs> and this one, this is just one option. Um, lastly, I got, these are two different type doors and I'm going to explain to you why. Um, these are great if you get a door and you don't necessarily need this outer frame. You don't have to use the outer frame. Okay. Um, so as I was saying, you can use this as a template to create other doors with paper, um, heavy cardstock, layers of them, or a foam core board, anything that you might have, or even other pieces of wood. Um, these are always great to use as templates, even though you may not need them. So at least you get the correct dimensions so you can create the scenes that you want out of um, your room boxes, your cardboard, your wood, however you want to do it to get the looks that you need. Um, so just remember that. And of course, like I said, you don't necessarily have to use the frames. You could just use the doors. It's just depends on what you want, but it's a beautiful door because it has all these panels, which I really enjoy. So this is considered a classic interior door panel. Love that detail. And then the last one is also a houseworks and all these are one twelve scale. That's what I work in. And, um, this is a six panel split. So this actually opens in the center. So if you wanted to, you can use one of these um, going into, let's say, into a kitchen from a dining room area, something like that. Or even in a bedroom, if you want to create a closet and add some foam core board or whatever to add some dimension to create a closet, you add this door, you add the little, um, the little door handles, you open it up a little bit, put some clothes, some shoes, some boxes, some things in there that you might normally find. And you create a whole nother dimension to your, um, to your project or, you know, the room itself. You can have lots of fun with different pieces that you just have to get creative. Again, um, this is great as a template and, um, door frames and what have you. If you don't need it, you can use it somewhere else in the house or create another room scene and use all these pieces to create what you need. So I, I felt like I did really well. I think I, um, I won all this for like 50 something dollars and I was re very pleased. I needed to Jamestown, but I also like to get additional doors because there, I do need some doors and what have you for some of my other houses and some other details, but this is really what I went for with the, um, with these beautiful um, side lights for the door, which are absolutely gorgeous. So I think I did really well. I haven't gotten anything from eBay in a very long time. And I was on the hunt for this particular door, but I wanted some other, you know, architectural items as well. So I did really well. So don't sleep on eBay as long as you know what you're looking for. So you make sure you get the right dimensions and the right thing for your hobby. They do sell, there's a lot of sellers on there that sell things that are out of scale. Um, you get them home and you're like, oh, what am I going to do with this? This is like too big or it's too small. So it's important that you educate yourself and you look at the sizes and you really try to relate it to things that you know um, will work. They also sell a lot of um, older pieces 
they go for like inside the 10 homes and what have you. I still need to find me um, one of those. So I have all those beautiful pieces that um, I got sent that were sent to me as well um, from um, another person here on YouTube. And I need to find a house to put it in because it's just absolutely fabulous. Those pieces that I have are beautiful and they're all vintage. So I need to find one of those 10 houses. So I'm on the lookout for those. Okay, well, that's it, you guys. I guess I'll talk to y'all later. And I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.